बसमीम् अलकुम होप यू ऑल आर फाइन आई एम एस महविश योर सोशल स्टडीज़ टीचर टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू स्टार्ट लेसन नंबर थ्री योर स्कूल टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू डू रीडिंग एंड एक्सप्लेनेशन ऑफ लेसन नंबर थ्री योर स्कूल सो टुडे वी विल लर्न मोर अबाउट योर स्कूल so what is a school do you know a school is an educational institution where students go to learn about topics such as reading writing and numbers under the directions of a teacher along with acquiring knowledge of a particular subject of different subjects this institute also develop and polishes their abilities it also helps to develop good habits and manners in the students so when we talk about a school we have different stages of education so it begins with the schooling begins with pre school the very first stage of your education is preschool preschool is a place where children go before they join a proper school means the primary school or the junior school so it consists of nursery and kindergarten so what they do they mostly learn by playing and enjoying they learn through activities so the child first join preschool which help them prepare for the primary school okay children are engaged in different activities like coloring reading learning alphabets and numbers so that makes their preschool that is their nursery and the kindergarten then comes then it comes the primary school so what is primary or junior school primary school or junior school starts from 1 and go up to 5 grade 5 once the student have done preschool they are ready to join primary school so now let's talk about primary school primary or junior school so now we are going to start the reading your school is called a primary school or junior school when you are older you will go to our senior school so when you are finishing when your preschool is done then you are going to start your primary school or junior school and then when you will get older you will go to a senior school that is from 6 onwards grade 6 onwards okay so have you observed when you are going to your school have you observed different places different areas in your school so let's first talk about classroom what is a classroom a classroom is a place where student spend most of his time it is a it is a room where almost 30 or 30 plus students sit at a time and they learn from their teacher classrooms are required because they provide a quiet space where students can sit and study different subjects okay now next so you i hope you are also having a playground there is a playground in your school so students playing football in the primary school so these are the grown up children these are not the small kids so they are playing football in the in the playground so what is the significance of playground a playground is important for everyone 
बिकॉज इट देर इज़ अ नीड ऑफ एवरी स्टूडेंट टू स्टे फिट फिजिकली सिंस फिजिकल एक्टिविटी इज इम्पॉर्टेंट सो इट इज इम्पॉर्टेंट टू हैव अ प्ले ग्राउंड इन अ स्कूल फॉर द स्टूडेंट्स येस इट देर इज अ प्ले ग्राउंड एंड द किड्स आर प्लेइंग एंड एन्जॉइंग इन दियर ब्रेक टाइम when students leave school they usually go to where they usually go to the college okay when they grow up when they complete their from grade 1 till grade 10 then they go to the college see students going to college some students also go to a university for more higher educations okay then so pre school then school primary school then senior school then we are going to college and after that for higher education for partic in a particular subject we uh, the students go to join the university see students at different schools and at college look like this in the first picture see the boy is playing with the is playing with he is playing with the toys so this is pre primary okay student is student is playing with blocks so it's pre primary that learning with fun next comes to primary school primary or junior school then the senior school means grade 6 and onwards and then it comes the college from 11th or first year they are going to join the college so they look like this okay so there are many things and many people in a school if we talk about a school a junior or a primary or a senior school we observe many things many people working in in the school so what is it yes it's a library so what is a library library is a place of knowledge and information where students can go and borrow books to increase their knowledge for a particular subject okay it's a place where you can find lots of books and you can go there you can take these books and you can read those books okay next here is the principal's office so there is a principal office i hope you have observed so the principal ensures that school operates smoothly okay next what is it yes it's a computer lab it's a computer lab computer lab helps you gaining practical knowledge of computer that you are going to learn in your books computer lab provides you opportunity to do to apply that knowledge practically so here is a canteen so the kids used to go to the canteen during their break time they buy some food and enjoy themselves during break time so the different things that you are going to learn during your primary or junior school that as it's a beginning of your school it's the base of your learning then that you are going to learn what you are going to learn writing the very first thing that you are going to learn is writing next thing is numbers they are also important and the next thing is you learn how to draw how to paint okay so these there are different things Le you are going to learn writing reading you going to learn about the numbers you are going to learn how to write how to draw how to color so you learn about many things in school so these are the few things that we are, have discussed in this lesson in the next lesson inshallah we will discuss it more till then take care allah hafiz watch this video twice for better understanding stay home stay safe allah hafiz take care